<laughs> Welcome back to the dark Kelly's being honorary. Kelly's always honorary. Yeah. Mm. Oh, she's I addicted really to the. Like I've already put the cream cheese in here to he save won't some time. Let me have it. And she just wants to eat the cream cheese. Oh gosh, well, that's good stuff. I have added, but it'll be tough to make the. <laughs> the I won't bother it. Okay, go ahead. Let, let me just make them, and you can just see. Okay. okay. So today's craft corner is a little bit different because I'm actually calling a cooking corner because I'll be showing you two of my favorite easy peasy recipes. And to start off, I'm calling these the easy peasy lemon squeezy cupcakes. <laughs> okay. Now, when I pulled out the cream cheese, Kelly thought I was making the frosting. Yes. Yeah. With the yeah. cream cheese. No, we're not. putting the cream cheese inside the batter of the lemon cupcakes. Oh, really? Because it's going to make it extra oh. creamy. Well, then now I want the lemon. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take an eight ounce package of cream cheese, mm -hmm. room temperature. That is crucial. Make sure it's room temperature. Now I'm adding a, what? It is. It's it hard is. to work with otherwise. It is. Yeah. 22 ounce can of lemon pie Look filling. Look at that, okay? boy. Lemon pie filling. We're going to add this in here. And this is uh, really tart and tangy, but with the cake mix we're putting in, it's going to kind of even it out a little bit. You have a fancy can opener too, don't you? I do. I like, do. I like can my can opener. Yeah. That's my personal one I, I brought from home. Can so I like the can? Steal it. You can lick the can. Yes, lick the can. The spoon. Like so now what you're going to do mm. after you've added the mm. pie filling and the cream cheese, <laughs> you're going to mix this together. So let me just mix this a little bit. They go I'll try to get it, Tom. Like <laughs> oh, that's right. You're not me. You're a in? professional. I and I love that Kelly can find the song with everything. I can find the song with everything. Can I put this in? in just one second. Okay. Let me mix this first. You want to mix this nice and creamy first. Let me just say, this is almost like a lemon mousse okay. when you get yeah. done because Let's that cream that. cheese and lemon pie filling it is so delectable. You could almost just chill it and eat it like that if you wanted to. Okay. Now, Kelly, can you add the? Yes. We're using a lemon did you want to taste that cake thing? mix. Before whole thing. thing. I kind of did, but oh, I won't. Yeah, oh, yeah, you yeah. can put your finger in there. Just oh there. no. No, stick your finger. Do it. No, oh, because no one okay. will. Try it. Oh. oh wait. Try it. Isn't that so good? So good. It's so heavenly. <laughs> Attention, what I'm doing here. I'm gonna, okay. Now, I'm not a, a cook or anything, but I'm going to say a plastic bag probably you don't want in there. No. <laughs> <laughs> um, just to let you know, too, I'm using a lemon cake mix on this. Right. If you wanted to have a little bit like a lemon buttery flavor, flavor okay. you could use a yellow cake mix. What I did experiment with okay. that. You know what? I experimented with angel food, and it rose so much in the oven. Uh -huh. oh, it it's got too much? ridiculous. Okay. It was super, super <laughs> high. I'm not kidding you. And you I know, try these for you guys. I try them first. Well, you have to try it first because yes. you never know what's going to happen. You never know uh, because it got so high and I took them out and then they shrunk. <laughs> And yeah. it was just, it was, it's yeah, I tried the angel food cake. Okay. I did. Okay. So I like basically, angel food cake. That's good stuff. Yes. So basically, here, you just want to mix this up until everything is good. perfectly, and it's going to be really thick, just so you know. It's going to be thick. Okay. Okay, so do not worry about that. Now, let me just tell you, I use my favorite, this is my ice cream scooper from home. It is the perfect size to put the batter in the cupcake pans. Perfect. Okay. So, I just wanted to now have you both try. Are you guys fans of lemon or no? Yes. Yeah. Okay. I want you guys to just try the lemon cupcakes just okay, to see what you I think. Can I just try the batter? And you want to try the batter? <laughs> Kelly just wants the batter. I see mm. that. Oh my gosh, it's good. Isn't that good? You know, you save yourself hours of work by just letting her eat the batter. Yeah, yeah here, you can have the batter. That is really okay, good. Okay, which one should I take? Which you, which you think is the best one? The finest work you've done? I noticed there's well, powdered sugar on yeah, it. Oh, too. I forgot to talk about the powdered sugar. Let me just say this here. briefly. You yeah. put this in your little um, colander. This is a little oh. shaker. And I love this because then, if you can catch this, look, you just tap it. You just that tap it. So cute. Tap it, and you put powdered sugar on it. And <laughs> Tom don't sneeze on it. But look, and it makes it very pretty. They're almost like lemon bars a little they, oh, bit. Yeah. Okay, right. okay so you gotta try those. This. Okay, I'm gonna so, tilt this so right. people look. So look at that. Oh. So and Isn't add as pretty? much powdered sugar as you want. Those and it's so, so Okay, you guys gotta try them now. And I'm gonna talk about my pumpkin spice. Tom, do you want to split one? Because I've already had yeah, about sure, a whole we'll one okay. with the You guys split that one. Let me set these over here. Now. Tell us about these two. Yes, because that was three ingredients. Cream cheese, pie filling, and the cake mix. This is two ingredients. And I'm telling you, it's my absolute favorite one we'll for September talking. and October. Yeah. It is a spice <laughs> cake mix with a can of pumpkin pie filling. You mix those, it's thick, you bake it mm. for 350 for 20 minutes, put your favorite cream cheese icing on top. They are absolutely delectable. Everybody in the studio has been wanting the pumpkin spice ones. Mm -hmm. But let me tell you, I posted the recipes. You can get both the recipes uh, at the Ozarks Live Facebook page. There's the easy peasy lemon squeezy recipe. Go share and like it. It's, if you save it, it goes into your photos for future reference. Okay. And there's also the pumpkin spice, the two ingredient. These are perfect for fall, but if you want something light and lemony, you can also make the easy peasy lemon squeezy. 
Both very delectable. Do you guys want to, Tom, do you want to try now, this one? Can I one? just tell you this? What? I think these would still be great with some cream cheese. Okay, on Kelly top. votes for cream cheese icing on yeah. the lemon ones. I As didn't well. like it. I experimented. No, it was I, very I didn't like you. it. Yeah, I, I didn't like it. These are very you, nice. You know, Tom, are, Tom, are you going to eat cream. that? Are you going to eat that? Are you going to try the pumpkin? One, yeah. Okay. Okay. I'll try one. Tom is actually going to try the pumpkin. Yeah, let's just watch that. Let's just watch this. This is, this is, this is, while Tom tries this, just so you know, up next, the Laura Ingalls Wilder Fiddle-Off takes place next weekend. We're going to get the details, plus a performance, next. So don't go anywhere. All right. How is it? No, no. I'm Jason Kander, and I approve this message. Is Washington working for your family? After 20 years there, it's working great for Roy Blunt's family. Senator Blunt voted to raise his own pay 12 times. He lives in a $1.6 million DC mansion, and his wife and three of his children are all lobbyists. When asked about the conflict of interest, Blunt said, I, I, I don't even understand why that would be a question. There is no question. Missouri needs a new senator. Tent Sale. Tent Sale. It's Creative Audio's Fall Tent Sale.